you get when you bring the number three Lake Clifton Lakers to Baltimore, Maryland, facing off against the number eight Baloo Knights? Well, you've got the Capital Hoops TV game of the week, and if you missed it live, we've got you covered. And let's jump right into the action. Here's a name you're not gonna wanna forget, Zalmiko Harmon from the corner, blew up early. Next possession, Josh Selby. I'm going up, no, I'm passing. Yep, I'm going up, it's good. Selby had 25 of his team's 52 points. Harmon again giving fits to the entire Lake Clifton team. They really didn't have an answer for him all night. Selby ahead to Jeff Fields, off the miss, who that? Kyrie Watson keeping things close with the putback jam. However, turnovers really plagued the Lakers the entire night. Zalmiko coming up with one here and the basket. He's not done there. Harmon did it all. 17 points, seven dimes. Here's one to Christian Leach in the corner. Awkward shot, but nevertheless effective. Selby really kept his team close in the first half. Two tray balls on the night. But more for Leach, getting in the lane. Spin move, tough left-handed shot, it's good. Difference in this one, really a tough defensive effort by Ballou. Here's Harmon stepping up, taking the charge. Blew up six after one, and then Harmon again, getting in the lane with the pull up. That's money. Harmon really was the key to Ballou's first half success. And then he finds Dante Thomas on the drive. Two of his five first half points, he had 24 in the second half. More Selby. Selby driving, that's good. Selby trying to keep his team in the game. But you can't forget about me, can you? He knew it was good before it left his hands. But here comes Lake again, Selby floater, good. Then finding Jeff Fields. They weren't done yet. Josh Selby, baseline. Nothing but net. Late down five at the break. Had more Selby. He's down to four schools. He's undecided. But that was a good decision. Late on a little bit of a run here. Down by one point. Kyrie Watson assist. It's good. The Lou got 53 points from their three guards. Here's two of Christian Leach's nine points for the game. Josh Selby. Step back. That's money. Crowd back into it. Josh is pumped. Then right back on the next possession. A little bit of fight in the Lakers. Diving for loose balls. Coming up with a timeout. Late down two. Right after the timeout. Selby to Deron Johnson. Three ball. Lake's first lead of the game. 37-36 third quarter. The missed layup then leads to a Dante Thomas reverse jam. Blue back up by one. We've got ourselves a game. But head on the break, easy two. Nope, Selby block. But look who's there to clean up, Dante Thomas again. Then Lake on the run, Deron Johnson two. Somebody in the crowd. Turnover is really a key for Lake Clifton in this one. Then Thomas on the step back. Kobe-esque, six unanswered for Thomas in the Knights. Another Lake Clifton turnover. I've got it, nope, I've got it, nope. He's got it. Up ahead to Dante Thomas. The two. Eight straight for him. Blue up 10. Dante 24 of 29 in the second half. What's that about? I'm trying to get my, get my team through this. Get, get them to go. Because I was playing, but I had to get myself to go first. Before. And then in the second half, I just came out half time. I just had to start getting them to go. They clipped in one last chance. Put the ball in Selby's hands and good things happen. Off the steal ahead to Kyrie Watson. Still down by double digits late in this one. But when Baloo needed to put the flame out, they called on Dante Thomas. And every time he delivered. Dante again on the drive, step back. He doesn't wear number 24 for nothing, fellas. And 12 unanswered for Thomas. And one. Baloo up 14 with two minutes left. Dante would later knock down the free throw opportunity for Lake Selby. No good. Rebound Baloo. Strong board. Up ahead to Dante Thomas. Finding Marquise Gentry. And it's Baloo with the upset win. 68-54. I mean, yeah, of course playing John Shelby. I mean, you know, I played against him at AU. He got me at AU. He played the Baltimore Stars. They beat us 76-72. You know, I 
know, I wanted to get him back a little bit. We were getting up at 5 30 in the morning to work out. So we feel that we were ready for it. You know, we, we already felt that we were going to knock him off. And it's a matter of time. It's very big. Win is so big. Words can explain it. Thanks for tuning in. For all of your DMV prep basketball needs and more, log on to www.capitalhoops.com. That's it from Baltimore, Maryland. Join us next Tuesday for the live broadcast of the Game of the Week, St. Francis Academy taking on Progressive Christian Academy. I'm Tim C., and we are DMV.